Downtown Proud Update is brought to you by Devon Energy. Eyes from around the city were on Oklahoma City last weekend as athletes hit the river for the canoeing and kayaking Olympic trials. The river has come a long way in just a few years. Darren Brown shows us another reason to be downtown proud. perception was it was really not much more than a ditch and for decades it sat here is, is really a place that we mowed three times a year and you know the fact that we wanted to build a boathouse you know at that time it was kind of a ditch front boathouse idea uh, you know there was there was a lot of skepticism those skeptics are a little quieter these days since the Chesapeake boathouse has been joined by the Devon boathouse and the finish line tower with others on the way who would have figured Oklahoma City to become a world player in the sport of rowing. Last September, we had Germany, uh, Italy, you know, Canada, uh, countries, major uh, forces in the sport of rowing coming to Oklahoma City with their Olympic team to race. It turns out the Oklahoma River, with its straight lines and high banks, is the perfect place for the sport. But there's even more. What makes this so powerful is not is that this venue is not 20 or 30 miles out of town, which is typically the case. It's right in the middle of town. They once called this place a dust bowl, but if you spend any time here now, you realize that it's become a haven for world-class water sports. The Boathouse District is just another one of those places that makes Oklahoma City downtown proud. Darren Brown, News 9. It is really amazing down there, too. It really is. It's beautiful. And, I mean, yeah, Oklahoma City. Mm -hmm. It's pretty, pretty awesome. cool. If you know of a place downtown you think we should check out, you can go ahead and tell us on our Facebook page. We're so excited for our very first.